in this video i am going to explain about uh, how to establish jdbc i mean java database connection in the previous examples we have seen already how to load the driver and how to register the driver oracle driver once the driver has been loaded now how to establish the connection so that we are going to discuss see after loading the driver in the driver manager class there is a method called get connection method it's a static method method name is a get connection it is taking three arguments so one is a connection string we can call it as a url and next one is a authentication of the database nothing but what is the username and what is the password if you pass all these three on success so nothing but if all input parameters are correct then it will return the connection object it will establish the connection and it will return that connection object that is the method is a get connection method get connection is taking three input parameters one is url one is a username and one is a password if all the three input parameters are correct then it will return that connection object so what is that url what is the username and what is the password here you need to understand about the url url equals to here this is the url jdbc api jdbc api is connecting with oracle database jdbc colon oracle using the driver that oracle driver what we have loaded is called thin driver actually thin and the next one is a server name server name means what where you have installed your database in my local host only i have installed so at local host every application runs from a particular port number in the computer here it is a standard port number is a 1521 and next one the service name the service name of express edition oracle express edition is a xe so where we can check all these things means what again if you open that installation folder of oracle oracle xe and here just search for a file called tns names dot oracle file tns names dot ora this is the file here it is just a right click and open with the, any text editor any text editor suppose edit plus i opened with the text editor and here it is in this tns names dot ora you can check what is the port number and what is the host of course my laptop name something it is there i didn't change but here it is better we use a local host applicable to every system and what is the service name is a xe express edition these are the things we need to provide in the url that is and next one what is the username and password nothing but the authentication authentication of oracle database now we are writing the program i am creating one file one class the class name is a db connection or db connect database connect here it is as it is a console application we are writing the code in the main method execution starts with main method and we know that we need to load the driver right always recommended is what class dot for me in the tri block why we have written inside the inside the tri block means what we know already because it throws exception if the specified driver or specified class is not present oracle jdbc driver what is it name oracle driver if that driver loaded successfully system dot out dot print ln just given the message is a driver loaded and here it is in the catch block we are handling the exception what is the exception class not found exception 
class not found exception giving the message exception no such driver no such driver to load we have seen this now how to establish the connection once the driver has been loaded then driver manager is a class dot what is the method name is a static method that's why we are calling using the class name get connection we need to pass three what are the three url username and password of course directly you can pass but i'm writing here string url equals to what is the url jdbc api connecting with oracle database using the thin driver at the server is a local host with the port number 1521 and the service name is xe that is and next what is the username we know that my username i have given to my system is a system and the password password here it is my password is admin all the three we provided so that get connection first one is url second one is a username and third one is a password if all the three values what you have provided correct then it will return the connection object we just collect that connection object that's all this is what we need to do to establish the connection system dot out dot print ln just a message connected to database connected to database here this common connection is belongs to that sql the driver manager class connection interface all these are present in sql package so that we have imported that is and now it is throwing that sql exception add throws declaration yes i don't want to handle simply that sql exception that's all here whenever we execute the code then you can see the output of this one say driver loaded driver loaded and connected to the database this is how we need to establish the connection with the database once the connection connection is created we need to close after establishing the connection nothing but after working with the database we need to close connection dot there is a method called close method then we are printing connection closed after performing all operations we close the connection then the same story whenever we are executing this now we are giving that driver loaded connected to database and connection closed connection closed this is the way but according to the exception handling rules right closing statements we have to provide inside the finally block right how to close the connection in finally block that we will discuss in the next video tutorial hope you understood please practice this application in your system thank you all